Hi there, so here's a quick review of these, uh, the second generation AirPods Pro. Now I've had the first generation ever since they were released about, what would it be, about five years ago. And I've always been extremely happy with them. Uh, the sound quality I thought was very good given the size of the speaker. And of course, as you'll know if you've uh, got any AirPods, they integrate beautifully into the rest into the rest of the uh, Apple ecosystem. They work great with your iPhone, your iPad, and uh, also, which a uh, feature I really like, the Apple TV. But the one area where I was slightly disappointed was the active noise cancellation. That was the reason why I uh, bought the uh, AirPods Pro uh, originally. I, I used to have a copy of the uh, a pair of the normal. AirPods, but then uh, when the Pro came out with the active noise cancellation, uh, I wanted that, so I, I bought the AirPods Pro. Now, it was okay, but was never quite as good as I thought it should be, and certainly not as good as Apple were claiming. Uh, there was, in fact, an issue, of course, with uh, some of the, um, the, the first produced ones or the early produced uh, AirPods Pro in the, with the active noise cancellation and Apple did in fact have a recall program um, uh, for them which I took advantage of. So I did actually get a uh, another pair and the noise cancellation of those was better but again still not uh, as good as, I, as I'd hoped. Now, when the second generation came out, and I, I read uh, read and watched some of the reviews, um, all the reviewers were saying how good the active noise cancellation on them was now. Uh, so I decided to um, see for myself. I, I bought a pair, and I have to say I do agree wholeheartedly with what the other reviewers have been saying. The, the active noise cancellation on the second generation AirPods Pro is a vast improvement. It really is now really excellent. Uh, it's as good, uh, if not better, than on uh, the AirPods Max. So whatever Apple have done uh, has has worked. Uh, I mean, the new AirPods have a new, I think it's called um, U, uh, H2 chip. Uh, the previous ones had uh, H1. Uh, and presumably uh, the improvements to the active noise cancellation come from that. Uh, they presume also, I assume, made some adjustments to uh, other aspects of the hardware and the uh, and the firmware. Um, I'm not an expert. I have no idea. All I know is that uh, it's now very, very good indeed. You can put the uh, AirPods in uh, and assuming you've got a, a good fit, and of course they now have um, an extra uh, pair of um cups that you ear cups that you can um, put on um, to make them fit uh, better uh, I say once you've got a good fit uh, and as you'll know if you've got any Air airpods you can test the fit uh, uh, with the um, software on your in your iPhone uh, I say once you've got a very good fit then you really cannot hear any background noise at all it cuts it out just about completely um, so whether it's a uh, hoover uh, whether it's uh, a washing machine, a lawnmower, uh, a fan, uh, then you put them in and, and it disappears. So it re they really are tremendous. Uh, now, Apple says that the sound quality has also improved with these second generation ones. And again, I would have to agree with that. I think they have more bass now and they have a, an overall better uh, sound. Uh, it's more rounded. It 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 just it just sounds uh, higher quality. Uh, I find that um, almost, and this is quite remarkable, really. But uh, I find that that the listening to music with them is almost as good as with my AirPods Max. Um, and given that uh, there's a, you know, one costs twice as much as the other, that that's that's very good. It's not as good. There's no doubt about that, but it's certainly uh, getting that way. Um, they also, of course, now have uh, the, the charging case has, has MagSafe uh, capability bit built into it. So um, charging the case using a MagSafe charger is now uh, much more convenient. The previous generation, of course, uh, always had a wireless charging case, but it wasn't MagSafe. 
So if you do have a MagSafe charger, such as a MagSafe Duo or something like that, um, or one of the Belkin MagSafe chargers, then you'll find that um, charging the AirPods uh, is much more uh, effective. I don't know if it's faster because of MagSafe, but certainly you get the benefit, of course, of, of, of knowing that when you put the uh, case on the charger, uh, because of the MagSafe, you know you'll be putting it, uh, putting it in the correct position. It's, it's a sort of a slight uh, improvement, I suppose, but, but nonetheless uh, useful. Um, apart from that, of course, the, the, the design of the, of the new generation is almost identical to the previous one. Uh, in terms of the, the, the shape uh, and the size, it's the same. The placement of some of the uh, speaker grills, I think, is slightly uh, different, but uh, you'd be hard pushed to tell the difference unless you really compare them side by side. Um, so, uh, and the case, of course, uh, is also the same, apart from the addition of a little speaker, which will sound uh, when you put them on the on the charger. Uh, it also, I think, uh, integrates with the Find My um, app in your iPhone, your iPad, um, so that the Apple has improved the improved the findability of the of the of these AirPods uh, Pro. So overall, I'm extremely happy with them. Uh, I say the main reason I wanted to get them was was in the hope that the active noise cancellation had been uh, significantly improved. And I'm happy to say that it, it, it definitely has. Uh, Apple's claims uh, in this regard are, are, are valid. I mentioned briefly uh, three other areas where Apple says improvements have been made in the second generation. The first is the uh, transparency uh, mode feature, which uh, has now been... Uh, updated or upgraded to what Apple calls adaptive transparency, uh, which, to quote Apple, harnesses the power of H2 to minimise the intensity of loud noises like sirens or power tools, so you can comfortably hear the world around you. Well, I have to say, uh, I can't say whether that's true or not, as I've, I've never actually tried it. I've, I never uh, use my AirPods uh, Pro in transparency uh, mode, I always have the active noise cancellation feature enabled, so uh, the transparency mode is not something I'm particularly interested in, so I can't really say whether it's improved or not. There's no reason to suppose that it hasn't if Apple uh, makes that claim, but as I say, I can't really, uh, uh, I can't say that I've actually tried it. The second uh, improvement uh, is in the spatial audio. Uh, feature or ability of the AirPods Pro. Now this has been um, improved to uh, incorporate uh, what Apple calls personalized spatial audio. This is something that I think was introduced with the latest version of iOS um, and the AirPods Pro second generation take advantage of this. Uh, again, I can't really um, say whether that um, is an improvement or not. Uh, as again, I, I've not actually set up the personalized spatial audio. All I can say is that I think the sp uh, spatial audio listening to, to movies with Dolby Atmos uh, and to uh, uh, music files, uh, Apple, you know, the Apple music files that have uh, the Dolby Atmos, I do think there is a, a, a better feeling of, 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 of spatial audio when you listen to them. Um, I don't think it's great on the AirPods Pro anyway. I think it's much better on my AirPods Max, but um, it, it does, I would say, there does seem to have been some improvement. Um, although it's not a, a feature that I'm, I'm particularly interested in. Uh, the third area uh, is battery life. Uh, Apple uh, says that this has been improved. Uh, well, I must admit, I never had any issues with battery life with my uh, first generation AirPods Pro. Um, I don't use them all day long, uh, so, so um, I can't say how long the battery would actually last if you were using them um, constantly throughout the day. But certainly for the use that I make of them, uh, the battery life has never been an issue. 
so if it if it has improved with this second generation then then great uh, it's it's nice to know but again it's not something that i can uh, say with any definitiveness as whether it has improved or not so overall as i say i think it's clear i'm very happy with this second generation i do think they are an improvement over the first generation particularly in the Two key, two key areas for me, which is sound quality and even more so active noise cancellation, which it really is now excellent.